which I have tried to get some attention for this situation, the fact that you're here this morning does mean a lot. He demanded that I have a sexual relationship with him and constantly insisted on telling me about his desire to have a sexual relationship with me. I rejected all of his advances and tried to ignore him in the hope that the harassment would cease and that he would simply let me do my job. I am taking the action of filing suit against the President and Mr. Mesny today because I have no other option. My savings have been depleted and I have been forced from my job, a, a job that I loved and devoted myself to. My only goal was to be permitted to do my job <clears throat> as a pastry chef in a safe and discrimination-free environment. Part of the, just to answer from a legal perspective, part of the reason uh, that you have the protection I'm not only surprised, I'm shocked. Uh, if uh, the employees at the White House were in private industry, they would be subject to severe censure, uh, if not uh, uh, discharge, for failure for three years to do anything. That, and there was a, an express statute by Congress that said they were required to enact these regulations by October 1 of 1997. So, that, surprise? Yes. Worse. Shocked. Uh, from the President uh, and some announcements. Uh, statement. That everyone here at the White House is committed to ensuring equal employment opportunity for all employees and we take any suggestion or allegation of employment discrimination seriously. As to the uh, idea that there are no, uh, there's no forum or format to uh, work through uh, complaints uh, or procedure, that's just not correct. There are internal uh, procedures that exist for all employees who wish to raise these kinds of claims. Um, uh, White House employees who feel they've been subject to discrimination uh, may file agreements with the White House Equal Employment Opportunity Office. These complaints are handled in accordance with federal anti-discrimination.